Hey friends and neighbors, little Doc here. I'm with Matthew. Hey folks. We're headed out to uh, out to Emerson to a gun show and uh, eyeball everybody's new projects and what they have for weaponry out there. But uh, hasn't been a whole lot going on this week. And uh, I went to the, had to go to the doctor this past week for a follow-up visit. And uh, I tell you what, the, the old Biden administration, they must be doing pretty doggone good because all the busy intersections there in Sioux City, they got people standing on the corner with cans. I pulled up the stoplight. There was, I don't know, five or six cars ahead of me. Guy standing there on the corner with a can in his hand, and most everybody was waving him off. And I thought, heck, I got a little. I rolled the window down, waved him over, and the guy he walks over, and just about the time he stuck the can in the window. The light changed, people started going, so I went ahead, I spit in the can and got rid of my skull and tipped my hat and drove off. I tell you what, when they can when the cities can afford somebody to stand on the corner with a cuspidor, the economy's gotta be good, right? So you that right, Matthew. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I think so. You know, it ain't very often when people stand on the corner holding a spit tune for you. But anyway, we're just going to ride along here. And I guess we'll let you enjoy some of the countryside and the hills that get farmed around here. Matthew and I, we have another video. We'll probably put that one out tomorrow, tomorrow Sunday. And Sunday's my usual day. I know here the last several months I've been just kind of posting whenever. But uh, I want to try to get back to the Sunday deal. So we're kind of out of the, out of the wicked hills for right now. Getting back to level ground. few of the beans out. There's some alfalfa over here. I don't know if they're going to cut that again or not. It's about 10 inches tall. Maybe we'll have Stewart Brothers come down and chop it for silage or something for one of the dairies. Thank you. 